What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here and the Switch has just been released. We're obviously all wondering about what the numbers are. Nintendo hasn't specifically revealed I think for the Americas, but they did for other regions like Japan and France. But I don't know if we right by now have an overall number, but they are saying that it's outsold the Wii within its launch. Then the Wii. So I mean that, that's pretty damn good to be honest. I mean, I don't know what it means for long term sales, but it's not a bad thing at all to see that the sales are doing so well. Anyways, we finally have word from Reggie and by the way Reggie where were you at the Nintendo switch line I was there waiting for you listen you, you better not have not shown up because I was there okay I feel like last minute this nigga was like Etika's there not nah, fuck that shit <laughs> you know no Reggie why didn't you show up man my body was ready my body was ready not to say that Doug Bowser wasn't cool in his own right I mean Doug Bowser's all right but he ain't no he, he he's not no Reggie okay he ain't no Reggie I'm glad at least somebody from the executive team showed up but I mean Reggie come on what's the deal and Anyways, we have an interview from Reggie on live TV that aired, I think, early this morning. I don't know when the fuck it aired, but it's something recent, and I thought it would be interesting to watch through this together. It's been a while since I've kind of watched any of the Reginator in action. The last time I think I saw him was when he announced that Galaxy 3DS, so this should be interestingly refreshing. He's done, like, online interviews with text, but I don't think we've seen an appearance from him in a little bit. So let's see what it is that Reggie had to say this morning on CBS this this morning should be interesting a little bit of a reaction video kind of get back into the groove of how i normally do things on this channel so let's see what it is that the reginator has to say about the switches the sales. Video or I'm, I'm assuming that it's about the sales but we don't know really game industry generated more than 30 billion dollars in revenue last uh -huh. year nintendo is having a strong start in sales you know it's kind of funny he says that as if it's like new information the game industry's been making bread dog what do you think this is nigga like, oh the game industry made 30 billion like no shit but i guess he's trying to convince the uh, older people that yes gaming is a big thing it's a big part of society now with the launch of that switch console it's oh newest yes gaming device it oh that's the yo that's still no good though there goes me in the back Nintendo yo my niggas hold on a second i don't know if y'all saw but your boy was in the background listen y'all don't think i play y'all think i don't play these games i play these games man i'm out here i was in the store right there my nigga see and i was right in that bitch man i was right there don't play with me dog don't play with me i'm, I'm in there trust me on that one the first five days after its release the portable gaming device by the way that's my nigga right there i know him of settings on your big screen tv on the road oh, man. Or at a party Reggie Fisame is the president and chief operating officer Reggie? of Nintendo. Reggie! <laughs> What's up, Reggie? Good morning. Thanks for having me. My 16-year-old son was the most excited about your visit. Uh, Yo. right. We love to hear that. Yeah. Because of this very device that's in front of you. And, and the Looking clean, by the way. Is, is kind of what's... What's the game changer here? You, you know, for this, the, the game changer mm -hmm. is every gamer wants to be able to have that big screen experience, but now to be able to, to have that and then take the system with you when you go, play in the taxi, in the Uber, play Whoa. in the subway, whatever it is, Reggie. that's the game changer and it's, it's going fantastically. He's telling the damn truth, man. Listen, I don't know how many people have looked at the Switch's functionality between going from console to TV, or rather from TV to handheld, and said, eh, whatever, it's not a big deal, but trust me on this, in action, it is a fucking game changer. I could be watching, the, I could be playing the Switch on TV, right? And then, like, I know, oh, a TV show is coming on that I want to watch later on, but damn, I don't want to stop playing 1-2 Switch because it's such an amazing, immersive, deep, tactical title, so... I have to stop playing on the TV, but then you're like, wait a minute, hold on a second, I got a switch, bitch! I can just go easily from the TV to the handheld, and you can watch your shows while you play again. It's so fucking cool to have in person. There's a lot of flaws of the switch, trust me, I haven't seen that video, the one with all the glitching and shit. Trust me, I'm not overlooking that. I'll probably talk about that later on. But the Switch is switching. Nigga, you can't fuck with the Switch right now when it comes to that shit. No Mr. way. Mr. President of the Air Adventure. Mr. President? <laughs> she addressed him as Mr. President? Okay. Okay, Reggie. I see. That's, that, that, that's, 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 Reggie's the big nigga on campus, man. Amazing. You know what my experience with Nintendo is? My son, who's now 29, my experience is, that's enough. Put it away. <laughs> Yo, it's kind of true, too. I had to tell my mom. Yo, mom, chill with the 1-2 Switch. She was beating me in some of those 1-2 Switch games. Games. I was playing that shit with my moms, man, and my mom hasn't played games in a long ass time. She kind of, she kind of was interested a little bit in Pokemon Go, but when we were playing One Two Switch, that's the first time in years that I played a game with my mom, and it was like really fun for the both of us. So props on that, Nintendo. That's one good thing about One Two Switch. At least it's good for you and anyone of any other age. So props. Stop it! You got homework to do. But what you guys have done now. 
Mm -hmm. so, it, it's so beautiful, I guess is the word I'm looking for. And I know that's yeah, not, right. not really a gaming term. But I look at what you do on the screen and I marvel at that. You know, one of the things that differentiates Nintendo is yeah, we've got the big games, beautiful yeah. graphics. But what we <laughs> big games, beautiful graphics. Yo, man, Reggie, I'm sorry. You know I love you and all that shit. But man, you, you said big games and beautiful graphics. It's true. I'm just saying that in comparison to the competitors, I think the potential for beautiful graphics is definitely on their edge. But I mean, hey, he's on he's he's on the goddamn CBS. He's gotta he's gotta put up as much of a claim as possible. But when it comes to graphics, beautiful, um <laughs> I got something called the PS4 Pro. I'm just playing around. I'm being an asshole. Please don't listen to me. I'm a horrible influence on society encourages people playing together especially ah. playing together in the same room you know, we've got a game called one two switch it literally ah, has a party in the box one two bitch this is an amazing title and what's different is you're playing looking at the person Yo, playing, arms man right you're not looking at the screen arms needs to hurry up and come really out really is a hallmark to what it is that we've been doing i can't wait to fuck niggas up in arms yeah, i was reading that 65 percent of households have a gaming device in their house who is your target no shit. market with this i think it'll be bigger so if you call it like mobile games really is consumers age 5 to 95 and when five i 5 to 95 there, nintendo has been on that man this is nothing new for y'all young boys i need to explain to you all nintendo's target audience from the moment that they started making game consoles till now has always been that large ass demographic i like that they still keep that criteria about their stuff it's it's kind of nice when you look at it from a consumer standpoint and not so much of a critique hardcore gamer standpoint you know what i mean it's cool it's cute say that it's a big it's, range it's a huge range look she it's fucked up grandpa with, no grandpa oh she fucked up grandpa it's a huge range but what, what how you shoot your grandfather we have grandparents playing with parents playing with kids with our types of content. it's true sure, it's true got zelda you know this fantastic immersive experience but we've got mario i just love seeing reggie on camera i love seeing this nigga each other and so you know, for us, we pride ourselves on having a very wide swatch of the market. Yeah, Splatoon 2 is going to be hyped. Even though this is Mario Kart. I don't give a fuck about Mario Kart, man. Yeah, fuck that nigga. You all know how I feel about that Mario, shit. Isn't it? Today is Mario Day. Yeah. Oh, it's Mario Day? What the fuck is Mario Day? R one zero. When you look at it, I like fuck Mario. Our, our fans have taken this and run with it, and, and you have there are about two dozen games for for the Switch so far. And if there's any criticism of this system, it's that some people wish there were more. So what we've, it's a launch system. I mean, but yeah, I so do what you're we've learned about this business is uh, here we go. it's not how you start. It's how you have that regular uh, momentum of new games coming out on a regular basis. So, yes, we started with a fairly tight slate, but we've got more games coming. We've got Mario Kart coming on the 28th of April. Mm -hmm, we've got mm -hmm. a new Mario game coming later on this year. There's going to be great content. And mm -hmm, yeah. as long as we keep releasing that content, we'll be able to drive our He only mentioned Mario. More girls are playing, and I asked this question. What about Senman Kagger? Very reliable sources about Link, the character Link. That Link is hot. Is Link hot to you? What? <laughs> Link is hot? Oh, 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 oh shit! It's about to go down. She said, "Wait a minute. Do you think Link is hot? He's a he's a man." Well, I don't know if Reggie's gay or not. It doesn't matter if he's gay, bisexual, or whatever. But I mean, I'm presuming he's straight. He asked me. Well, okay. Uh, even I'll admit, man. Link in the in, in the newest game, Breath of the Wild, Link does kind of look on point. But I mean, I'm not saying that as I'm interested. I'm just saying it's an observation. He's a handsome individual. That's it. But she asked him. She put him on the spot. What you doing, to Reggie? What you doing? That boy, leave him alone. You gotta say, Link is hot, but yeah, but he, he said it. More Link is hot, man. And we pride ourselves. He said it. Did, 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 did he more? Good looking guy. More, more girls like are that. playing video. It's hot. <laughs> the character Link. That Link is hot. Is Link hot to you? <laughs> uh, Link is hot. I, I gotta say. <laughs> what? <laughs> Let it be known right now. Let the fan fiction begin. Reggie X Link. Let it happen right now. He, he just quoted right there. Link is hot. Words from Reggie himself, man. I can I can just... God, Deviant Art is going to be on fire this weekend, dog. Like, oh, God. Reggie, why did you do it? Link is hot, but yeah, more, Link is hot, yeah, nigga. More girls are playing <laughs> video games, and we pride ourselves that we've been able to lead that charge, right? Yeah. With My with girls. the Wii, with the DS. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I have a nine-year-old and an eight-year-old. A lot of girls play games now, yeah. definitely. So that they're your target audience, exactly. really. I think I think these reporters, you know, they're definitely good-willed. Their their hearts are in the right place, and they're genuine about being excited for this new system. But um, 
Girls have been playing games for a very long time now. That's not new information, but like I said, it's an older demographic. We need to update them with these numbers, and there's nothing wrong with that. So don't be too critical. It's just an observation that I noticed. You know, you know me. Yeah. Exactly, and we're you know we're getting more and more kids to play this, and, and candidly, it's good from an educational standpoint. Minecraft, is. fantastic game on our system. It is. You know, it's a great way for kids to. Get wait, wait, Minecraft. I don't see no Minecraft. Think about creating uh, interactive environment. So it's it's good for kids' brains. And would you leave Minecraft good for kids' brains? That's another huge quote from Reggie that I think is going to be taken completely out of context. One, Minecraft is a horrible fucking game, and anyone that still plays it is probably the worst thing in gaming right now. So please, Reggie, don't do it to yourself. You already did enough this interview, okay? Just leave it alone. <laughs> oh, yeah. Absolutely. You would like the friends and family discount. Thank Absolutely. you, Mr. President Reggie. Please and email. Gail, can you get his email? Yeah. Yeah. I want his email. Thank you so much for Give me Reggie's email. Today. Thank you. But all right, so that was the interview that Reggie had on um, CBS. It wasn't really too much information revealed there like I thought there would be. But I mean, hey, it was still all in good fun. And to be honest with you, I'm really happy just to see Reggie on camera again. I can never get enough Reggie, man. But this, this interview, it was funny. It was really, really funny. And there were a bunch of quotes that could be taken from it. One, Reggie stating, for the masses, he thinks Link is hot. <laughs> I can, I'm telling you, I see where that's going. And then also, you know, talking about how girls are now more influenced in gaming, you know, stuff like that, little stuff. I think it was a cute little interview, man. Nothing wrong with that at all. Reggie is always a blast to have on camera. The only thing that I see is wrong with this interview is him stating that Minecraft is educational and good for kids' brains. No. But anyways, guys, let me know what you think of this interview in the comments below. You know, I joke around a lot, but in reality, I love Nintendo. Reggie, one of my idols. So, I mean, all in good fun. I'm fucking with you. I'm roasting niggas, all right? But I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Take care of yourselves. And, of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.